Hey everyone, welcome to the Rollamon's Iceberg. This iceberg is going to cover a little bit of Rollamon's history, controversies, and so on. I've been told that this iceberg is a little bit incomplete when it comes to certain information, so if you guys would like to add something onto it, please feel free to in the comments, and I might make another part of this iceberg. Thank you so much, and now, here's the iceberg. The wrap based removal. Before the currently existing method of changing values, which consists of having to make proofs for every single item, regardless of its size, there used to be a different value changing system for smaller items. Going off its recent average price, the wrap, and not from proofs. Let's suppose your item has a recent average price of 48,000 Robux. Its value would theoretically be 50 to 55,000 according to the wrap based chart. The system was abused due to users selling an item for 1 Robux, causing its wrap to drop significantly, resulting in the item lowering in value. The wrap based system was then replaced by the proof based system. Corrupt Value Changers and Reais Red Balloons It is highly speculated amongst all members of the community that Rollamon's value changers are corrupt and use the system to their advantage. One reoccurring example of this is Reise's Red Balloon Horde, which many users believe is often given an unfairly big raise when compared to its proofs. Fake Proofs The value request channel is the place where all proofs go on. Some of those are unfortunately fabricated by one or multiple users to make their item or items seem better than what they actually are. Trading YouTubers This entry is what the name suggests. Broadly known Roblox trading YouTubers such as Lonnie, Waffle Trades, Highly Wanted, Kevy, etc. Old Rank Roll System Before the Mi 6 leveling system was introduced to Rollamons, there was a message based system, which consisted of the amount of messages sent by the user. Regular being 1000 messages sent, active being 5000, and so goes on. Discussion Updates the discussion updates channel was used to broadcast discussions for items. Once an item entered or failed discussion, a message would be sent there by a value changer. However, this started being used for the purpose of sharking, leading users to overpay or lowball items more, depending on the situation of said item, once it started being discussed. Nowadays, only failed discussions are broadcasted to discussion updates. UUC. UUC was a user who discovered a glitch within Roblox in 2020 that allowed him to send a fake offer which when accepted would make your items go to his inventory and he would get to keep his own item. He was terminated shortly after, but another glitch was found during February and March of 2021 that allowed multiple users to take advantage of this glitch, causing multiple users to be scammed. Roblox did roll back these trades and most of the users got their items back some unfortunately did not. Hashtag not racist. This entry of the iceberg is about a clip by famous Roblox trading YouTuber Lonnie, declining a golden Roblox and offer. He said some uh, rather devious things in this clip, causing it to always be remembered every once in a while. 60. This, this nig is trying this nigga. Hashtag not racist. RBX rocks. RBX Rocks was a website created by Bahig. It is known nowadays as Rollamons' most relevant predecessor relative to size. The website went through a backdoor breach back in 2018 or 2019. At the same time, Bahig was losing credibility, slowly killing the website due to his demoralized stance. RBX Rocks ended up being ultimately shut down and sold to keyloggers and cookie loggers. There was also this paragraph sent by Doxed with Health of Poseidon. Summarizing the situation and a lot more. If you want to read it all, feel free to pause the video. Thank you Doxed for this very valuable information. Ravanai. Ravanai used to be Rollamons' richest value changer, with over 120 million limited value, and a horde of 25 Warclock Ultimates Aquamarine Attitudes. It was discovered that he was talking to miners in a sexual way and also liked being a cuckold, causing a mass mocking from the community. He was terminated shortly after for holding poisoned limited items, and will most likely never return. Deflation Good This entry refers to Rollamon, the creator of Rollamons, who once saying Deflation Good. Could not find anything else related to this entry. Fake Rollamon This could be referring to an alternate website or just the abundance of server members with Rollamon as their name. Social Rejects Social Rejects is a Roblox group, mainly focused on trading, which allows almost every banned Rollamons user in. It's basically a rule-free Rollamon server. Suga's 2000 plus meows. 
This entry refers to a user named Suga, who has said the word meow over 2000 times. <laughs> Windbreaker and I like foxes XP wedding. This entry refers to a joke wedding planned by those two users. You are currently seeing footage of what the wedding place used to look like. Very cute. Shedletsky. Shedletsky is an ex Roblox employee and he is in Rolamon's server, although extremely inactive. He would also use trade bots to send trades way back in the day. Dollar sign Grubby. Back in 2022, user Recruity made a self bot which allowed a picture of his chat to be posted when dollar sign Grubby was typed in chat. However, his account was banned from Rollamons due to new users spamming this command in various channels, including value requests. He rejoined shortly after, however, the command does not work anymore. March 5th, 2023, Sin Ping. In March 5th, community team supervisor Evil underscore Sin accidentally pinged the regular role which a large portion of the Rollamon server has. He did that when trying to ping the user regular underscore show. A lot of memes were made about it. Couch pics. This used to be a channel in Rollamon for the purpose of... sending couch pictures. <laughs> it was made for Rollamon's 2021 April Fools event. However, it is reported that it could still be seen by a handful of users even after April Fools. It has been deleted or privated ever since. Flonks Ben. Flonks was a high-ranking member who had ties with many of the server staff. He abused his position to harass others and post not safe for work content. Eventually, there was some inside scandal with him and his staff, leading to a permanent ban. Guess who just got Valk? This is a widely known message sent by user Western Union of an ungodly ugly Valkyrie Helm outfit. At the time of recording this video, the message has over 1600 downvotes. It is likely the most reacted message sent by a community member in Rollamons. How Bikers Eat Their Steady This was a server-wide meme a few years ago, and was also elected best roller meme of 2020. Popularized by Who's Trade and others, this meme will always be a part of Rollamons' culture. 25 Reactions Back in 2022, user Lebradoss sent an image of a wedding with the caption 25 reactions and I destroy everything. The image eventually got more than 25 reactions. However, the aftermath is a... Uh, unknown. Doxed videos. This entry refers to old videos by Roblox Trading Community's owner. Doxed. This most likely refers to his video raising some concerns about Rollamon's value changers under raising his hoard of neon green crazy crowns while over raising an item owned by a value changer, the item in question being Ops Warrior. Other than that, I got my friend Poseidon to ask Docs about anything else, nothing major. Pause the video in case you want to read the screenshots. Thank you Poseidon and Docs for collaborating for this bit of the video, much appreciated. SQL date. The February 2022 red bandana of SQL injection standal, commonly referred to as SQL gate, was a standal involving value changers Vice and Revanai. After receiving just one proof, it was decided that the SQL bandana's value needed to be raised. Shortly thereafter, the value increased from 1.3 million to 3.2 million, a 1.9 million increase. Value changer Vase had only two SQL bandanas, increasing his total value by 3.8 million, while value changer Revanai had one himself, which was acquired just one week before the raise. It is widely believed that the SQL bandana did not need a raise of 1.9 million value, but rather that the value changers increased it by such a large margin in order to receive a big payout. Thank you so much to TJ for the paragraph by the way. Rep Eater Werewolf Breeder Rep Eater used to bring his job as a werewolf breeder at seemingly random moments, sometimes accompanied by an image of a grey plastic bottle with the label reading Werewolf Milk. It is almost like an inside joke. The Me6 Hack A while ago, the Me6 bot suffered a hack, causing this image to be posted in the announcements channel in Rollamons. Pretty funny stuff. Slurs before 2020 This entry refers to slurs being allowed within Rollamons before 2020. Matter of fact, rules were non-existent during the year of 2018, until the server started getting major traction. Rules have been put in place ever since. Qless Lemon This is the first image pinned in the lounge channel in Rollamons. It is basically a lemon with the username Qless written on it. Mikey Gate Previous staff member Mikey intimidated another member of the Discord server, Emmy, because of Dominus Arias dropping. I cannot seem to get these documents straight. However, by the looks of it, Amy proved something that Mikey and his friends told her not to, and then proceeded to threaten and intimidate her. The document links are on the screenshot in case you want to take a glance. 
Mob Mob. More known as Mobile's Mob, it was a 2020 trend in Rollmons. It lines up with trends like MRGA's Lowe's Mice. However, Mob Mob is unheard of nowadays. Stake Took My Soul. Upon typing Stake Took My Soul in any Rollmons channel, the bot will assign a meat emoji reaction to the message. The origin of this inside joke is unknown, but is still commonly used to express reactions to certain topics. Tentacles Jr. Lore This entry essentially refers to user DHOM916 selling his Void Star to purchase a lot of copies of limited item Tentacles Jr. right after its release. Its value at the time was 100,000 or more and DHOM916 ended holding his Tentacle Jr. horde for way too long, causing him to lose a ton of value in the process. Sunset Gamerface Sunset Gamerface was a troll in the Rollamon server. This user would usually type out a short sentence, write it in all caps, all bold, and repeat it multiple times, once every few minutes, before changing his question. He was banned sometime later, most likely due to being underage. Be water, my friend. Be water refers to a node moderator's final message before quitting slash leaving. It was a long essay on moving on, and he concluded that you have to be malleable, like water. Pause the video in case you want to read the whole message. V8P gate. This entry refers to user V8 being in one of Rollamon's voice channels. For your own safety, I will not be showing any clips of the incident. Fungus data R34. Uh, you know, the name already explains it, bro. Come on. Return of Charts. Charts was a very relevant member of the Rollamon server, who was permanently banned for repeatedly breaking the rules, doxing, scamming and allegedly compromising accounts. He occasionally revisits the server with alternate accounts. Thank you so much Rollamon for helping me with this bit of the video. The 2018 Logo Creator This logo was made by a friend of controversial user Zizzer. Not much else to note about it. Rollamon's Teal Logo This was Unite's original submission for Rollamon's January 2019 logo contest. Rollamon just edited the color to Rollamon Blue. The Clown That Hides From Fail Traders The joke here is, if you cannot see the clown, that means you are the fail trader. This joke is very unknown by most of the community, myself included, before I started researching for the production of this video. When we were younger, me and my cousin would F word. And I think this is very self-explanatory. So this was the Rollamon's iceberg. Thank you to everyone, in special I Lemons for helping me with the making of this iceberg. Without his help, I wouldn't have known basically half of the things in this iceberg. So thank you very, very much for the help. If you enjoyed the video, make sure to like it, subscribe to my YouTube channel, and join my Discord server. Thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.